I'm excited for this one. Today I'm gonna go ahead and do the spring mod upgrade on the pilot controls on this one. So excited I got a head start already. Um, at this point it really looks like pretty straightforward as far as pulling these access plates here. It is just a single five millimeter Allen head bolt. And then once that's done, it's just a, a pop free type of disassembly, pull it apart. And then once we get in, here's the pilot control pistons that the springs go around and uh, really not much more to it. I would double check all of your bolts while you're in here. It's good anytime you do anything on this unit to double check the, the nuts and bolts just to make sure. Here are the springs and this is pilotspringmod.com is where I got these. These are the Gen 2. These are the copper. I'm presuming, uh, looking at them a little bit closer, it looks like they are oxidized a little bit, which would be telltale that it is copper. So let's get into it and get them installed. All I have to do is lean this in here, push that piston down, drop in the spring, rinse and repeat. Do it three more times on this side and four more times on the other side. Really all this does is it creates some resistance on these pistons because uh, without them, they're pretty free moving. Um, really quite surprising how much they move. See now it's a lot more resistance and it springs back. Let me go ahead and zoom in to the other side over there. How little resistance there is because here you just, it's pretty floppy. This adds a lot of dampening to it. So. I'm gonna go ahead and get that other side done. We'll go ahead and fire this off and see what kind of difference it makes. Same thing again over here, another five millimeter hex. This one I haven't taken off yet, so you're gonna to get to see how easy it is. So it's just a matter of loosening that, snap this out, slide it off. Again, that pretty quickly exposes under the boot here all of the pilot control pistons. So I'll go ahead and get the springs on here, button this up. It's right here. Honestly, it's probably about the most challenging part. The springs went in super easy. Uh, this dust cover, it's got a little lip here that it goes around. So if you just put two fingers on there, wrap it around, pull it there, it's down and on. Go ahead and slide the trim piece back in. Start that one by hand. All right, snug, don't want to over tighten it. This is plastic. Big difference. It really smooths them out. Definitely a worthwhile upgrade, I'll tell you. My biggest concern with this unit after I've put about two hours on it was really spinning the house on it. Uh, just kind of the clunking and clanking. Uh, initially I got under there, there were a couple of bolts that were loose uh, that I went ahead and tightened up. But I think at doing the spring mod on the pilot controls is gonna make a huge difference as far as not creating that abuse as you cycle back and forth while you're digging. Uh, but this was a quick, short one. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed it. If you have any questions, please reach out, leave them in the comments. Thank y'all. See you on the next one.